The atmosphere here is one of concern, as there is still no news of 10-year-old Sean Mars, who disappeared yesterday. A recent report indicates that the police are now treating this as another kidnapping by the origami killer. If this information is confirmed, he may still be alive. Hello there, sweetheart. What can I do for you? After their abduction. I'd like a room. Obviously, time is running out for you? For the Anything. Trying to hmm. find the child. I'm Feeling the red just there. Madison page 27 single how long will you be staying with us Ms. Page I don't know yet room 201 Last floor, stairs on the right, in the courtyard. Thanks. The pleasure was all mine. That's for sure. Sir? Are you all right? I'll call an ambulance. No ambulance. You're badly hurt. You need a doctor. Please, just help me to my room. It's number 207. You got the key? You're really in bad shape. You should see a doctor. Must have one, maybe two broken ribs. It's not fatal. <laughs> but it's sore as hell. <sighs> Your head is bleeding. It looks deep. I should disinfect his cuts. I'm gonna disinfect your wound. This might hurt a little.
There. At least it won't get infected. Thanks. Paracamol painkiller. Administer in cases of intense pain. Do not take more than one pill every 24 hours. Necofrin 100 antibiotics. Administer to combat infection. Here. Take this. It should do you some good. What is it? It's an antibiotic. An antibiotic? I'm no doctor, but I don't think there's any risk of infection with a broken rib. Okay, I'll see if I can find anything else. Paraphenol anti-fever. Administer only in cases of high fever. Paracamol painkiller. Administer in cases of intense pain. Do not take more than one pill every 24 hours. Here. Take this. It should do you what some good. It? It's a painkiller. It'll help reduce the pain. It says on the box to take one every 24 hours. I don't think it's a good idea to exceed the dose. I can't afford to wait. I wouldn't move around for a few days if I were you. I, I'm gonna take a shower. All right. Let me help you. I'll wait here until you come out. Let me know if you need anything. Talk to me. That way I'll know if you pass out. What's your name? Madison. Are you staying in the hotel? No, I live in town. I suffer from chronic insomnia. I seem to only be able to sleep in motels. Don't ask me why. Whenever I get too exhausted, I, uh, I come and spend a night here. I'm... I'm just passing through. And what else do you do, Madison? Apart from fixing up strangers. I'm a photographer. I take pictures of uh, furniture for fashionable design magazines. And you? I... I'm an architect. Thanks for staying. I feel a lot better now. Okay. I better get going then. By the way, you never told me your name. Ethan. Be careful, Ethan. 